teams for sides and get ready to go. This is period two action live from the Cody Memorial Rink. EHF PB Tier 1 Black Division Playoffs. Preliminary game number two for both of these teams. And it's the Manchester Flames up 2 0 on the Boston Trudy Eagles. They are on the power play for a minute to here to begin the second period. And right off the draw, they have the puck in the Oza. Murphy centered! And it was right behind the stick of Fleisick. Uh, Novak tied him up there up to the play two to make sure he didn't get a second opportunity in. And now Novak was going to be in. But that lofty pass was bouncing over a stick. Uh, 38 seconds still to go, and Murphy moving it for Pelletier. Auerbach got caught. Here comes Pelletier driving right to the net, and he scores! What a goal by the Flame defenseman on his own end. Hash mark to hash mark, and Pelletier with the power play goal. It's 3 to nothing. Boy, I'll tell you, the defenseman for the Eagles, too, Aberbach. Uh, I don't know what he's doing. He gets caught on that play. He's somewhere up and above the red line. Uh, and the play is passing him by. His other uh, defensive partner, I think it might be, I don't know who it was. Hold on a second. We got another defenseman caught for the Eagles. And this is actually a two-on-one for the Flames. Bless coming through, sends it back in front. And it was Riccio deflected into the corner. Bless comes up with this puck out of the corner now. Uh, out of that scrum, he said to for Young who missed it at wide. Flames on it again. Here's Riccio, his wrist shot, gloved uh, and held by the goalie. Got a whistle, but two. I'm not going to call Aberbox a pinch because not a pinch, but that was a two poorly timed step ups by Eagle defenders. Really let the Flames really open up this game. From 2-0 to 3-0 and potentially 4-0. Uh, Maurice, I don't know who he's trying to turn back to. And he lost the puck and took a penalty. Eagles are still going to come up and ahead as Maurice is going to head to the box for a trip. Right. Puck is touched up by Zachary Baker. Uh, Maurice is going to head of the box, uh, visibly frustrated. <laughs> and the Eagles are going to head back to the power play. I believe this is the second time the game, since they're 0 for 1. Uh, but the face will be to the left of Tristan Kerr. Uh, Darity versus Novak in the draw. And right off the bat, it's in the referee skates. Doug free by Greenberg. Kopf, uh, Greenberg had that chance on the first power play for the Eagles, uh, which looked pretty good up until Manchester got their first clear, and then Eagles couldn't regain the zone. Greenberg had to step back for this puck. He's playing a little bit of a catch with Kopf right now. Greenberg on the near point, pressured by Dermody. Back in low. Eagles still moving around here. Uh, Novak, uh, Greenberg again. They're going to try to move it away from that area. Greenberg will do it himself. Although he fanned on the pass and Dermody picked it off. He's going to look to get going. Harry Dermody up the left side. Crisscross one for Baker. And a good stop by the goaltender. He came side to side. Uh, boy, I don't think anyone, including myself, saw Zachary Baker coming in up the right side there. He got ahead to... Uh, Look at his plant. And the only guy in the building that did, I think, was Harry Dermody, who, instead of taking it to the cage, which he had some space to do, he laid a crisp pass in for Baker right in his wheelhouse. And the goaltender coming from right to left had the checkmate. To Nothing you could uh, be frustrated about right there if you're Zachary Baker. You got a good shot. Mr. Bolton just made a better save. Uh, Kylie flips one down. This should be icing. He didn't gain the red line. Uh, Kylie tried to beat it out. Uh, well, the referee has his back turned. He's not going to get that call. Uh, and we're going to come back here. 21 seconds left to go. Left to go. Excuse me. 21 seconds left to go. In the Eagle power play. Uh, 
And they're going to bend down below the bunting here. And it's 12-01 to play in the second. I explained the bunting this morning. It's very decorative, very nice, but blocks out the view of the clock. Uh, here's a shot from the line. Never made it through to the rebound. It certainly did. Uh, on the far post. And Tristan Kerr, who got the shutout this morning. He got a shutout last Sunday in the semifinal of the New Hampshire State Tournament. Uh, He's been on his game, uh, and he makes another save right there. Uh, Murphy nearly got in the way of that pass. Smithers just like a wild horse up the left side. Uh, <laughs> he, he goes down, and the puck go off his leg. Fysik now into the zone. Can't get in the same boat with Murphy right now. Uh, and Lyon had a bit of communication issues this morning, too. Cox is on in place of Kylie right now. Uh, hello. Kylie was the first one to step off, and Murphy will be the last as Fysik is off at exchange for Bless. Uh, Novak now. He's going to gain the zone onside as Greenberg in the right of your screen. Buck in the slot. This is going to be a backhander. Uh, never made it to the cage after it got blocked, I think, by uh, Manchester Sick. Uh, Smithers coming ahead. McDonough back to Smithers again. And Manchester's going to get in the zone. Here's Smithers taking a look. Uh, I think he's trying to go for Reggio there. No way Brian's going to get a stick on that one, and he didn't. Uh, Reaching out in front of a bus, and he's spun one in front of the goal. And pad stop was made. Uh... Ooh, there's an Eagle player down. He was away from the play. Bless is holding his mouth, too. I don't know if they got some sort of stick collision. The puck was closer to the wall, and Bless and, and Eagle were tied, tangled up. Uh, and I think that's Bello is get to return to his feet. Uh, Levy speaking in there to the referee. Still down. Uh, coach on the ice, but not providing any assist. Uh, referee down with his knees to the park as Bello is up on his as well. I don't know if he's arguing about a penalty or just a little bit of morale. Talk they got him there, but he's not he's gonna stick to the bench now, Bella Will. Uh, Les was holding his mouth too. And kind of crouched over as he headed the bench, trying to uh, uh, escape the scene of the crime as quick as possible. He's still on the ice for this face-off. Uh, I guess he didn't head to the bench. I thought that's where he was going. Uh, uh, but I don't know if he had something to do with that. Uh, Cox fairly bodied Silverman off the puck. Uh, the better fit of that uh, is Bless uh, Rister. And save has been able to stick from the top of the face-off circle. Paladino now. Back in low for his defenseman. He's got two red jerseys on him. Uh, Riccio uh, pushed into the boards. He's going to trickle up to the side of the cage. Bless had a hack on it. Comes back onto the wall, and Paladino will clear it up the middle. Silverman gained the line, McKee following. Uh, can't drive towards the middle of the ice. Now Young off the bench is Baker. So Young is going to pick up some speed. This is a two on one. Young coming in. And the save is made with the stick there. Kind of a pushed shot along the ice there. And back the other way, it was Novak with speed. He's got Greenberg with him. Novak waiting in front for Greenberg. And the pass was blocked there by Young. Uh, who came all the way back to be the only defenseman left in that situation. I don't know where everybody else is. He goes goal line to goal line in that play. And now it's Folsom, the only guy back. Go back in front of the goal, and he roofed it high. It was in close uh, as Greenberg 
threaded the needle to give it to him. And now we're going to come the other way. If Baker can catch up to this puck. Uh, Fire wagon hockey right now from Cronin. Uh, and here comes Greenberg again. Yeah, this is a three on two. And a poke check there by Folsom. Stops any thought of a chance by the Eagles. Uh, here comes Germany now driving to the slot. Swatted out of harm's way by the Eagles. And neutral territory. This will be Grumwald. 8.30 to go in the period. 8.30? No, not 8.30. By six for Kylie now. Uh, 30. Billy. Here's Baker. Hold on a second. Baker, a high shot. And it was exactly that high at about the crossbar. 830. Whoa. <laughs> We've been recording for 10 minutes this period. Oh no, I guess it makes sense. Two minutes to stop his time. Uh, 30. That seems like a lot, folks. <laughs> Wait. Yeah. I don't know. I'm not going to do the math. Here's Gron Mold coming in. He has a shot knocked up and into the mask of the goalie. After Murphy went down, Murphy's back up, sending it to the line for Folsom. Deflected in front. Kylie with a drive. Loose score! I think that's going to be Liam Murphy banging away in the crease. Uh, it's first of the game, and Manchester's fourth. Uh, they've quadrupled their lead since the first goal by Hemingway. It's four to nothing. Buck got in behind the goaltender there. Grommel was in the vicinity, too. I wasn't sure if it was going to be him who knocked it home, but if he was down there or... Uh, Set out in front now, backhander! And Curve sealed the five hole. We can seal the daylight from here. And Tristan Kerr just continues to come up strong. Standing tall there on the puck in his crease. Uh, I'm not gonna do the math, but from the last Granite State Wild goal on Sunday to the entire 45 minute game this morning. 15 minute first period uh, in this game and now we're about five minutes into this snow. Excuse me. <laughs> Eight minutes into this, uh, this second period. He's got quite the shutout streak rolling. Banging away at the side of the net there was Cox. Uh, can't nudge one past the Eagle tender. Uh, Offensive zone draw for Manchester over the left side. And blesses to take it. Bellow back on the ice, by the way. Uh, he skated. He was down for a minute or two. Skated to the bench himself, though. Uh, and he's back. Next schedule shifts. Uh, it's Paschak. Uh, Paschak still on that puck. After I thought he was going to lose it. Cop from the line. Uh, he's going to send it over for Bellow. Quite in front of the net. Uh, and it... Skipped across the crease and out the other side. Bellow is open again here. Eagles can't wrap it around. Frames a mess in the defensive zone. He has Bellow trying to go inside out on Young. Goes far post and then a shot somehow came through there. He missed wide of the goal. Chance to clear now for Riccio and he just will. Cox a four, four checker for Manchester. You have to forgive me for some of the long pauses in commentary. Not necessarily as, uh, oh, look at, look at Young. <laughs> he just, he walked right through his crease. Uh, very dangerously. All it took was a poke check, and that puck would have been in the net. Uh, here's Maurice. He stood up nice, clean. Uh, right there, it's about his back end. Uh, as clean on Maurice. He drives right in the body of the defenseman there. Everybody on this puck. Chips it around and the defenseman still going. He's going to feed a far side. Pulls him a drive. And it goes deflected by Baker in the slot. And went into the corner. That was a hard shot too by Brian. Uh, here's Maurice trying to kick it towards the cage. A few dangles. And then a backhand shot missed up high. 
This line still working. Go, uh, Germany for Gromwald. Gromwald on the wall. Hard drive there. Save with the glove. He got the rebound though. Eagles are gassed right now. And the Flames are running a clinic in the offensive zone. Kopf over skate of the puck. Uh, Baker couldn't steal it from him though. Chance for Boston to clear here. They will on the breakout pass. McKee. McKee. Uh, out wide on Folsom, Baker bodies him away. Hey, oh. And McKee was toppled quickly. Uh, I don't know about that one, folks, but an arm is up. Uh, and they're trying to call Baker for a check. Uh, and that's so that's something we wouldn't have seen called in the, uh, the state tournament last Sunday, so it's a little bit interesting. Uh, uh, comparing the physicality levels. And I talked about this this morning as well. The EHF and NHA. AJ, yeah. of course, the New Hampshire State League. Manchester State Flame playing both. Uh, you know. That was that would not be something that would have been called. Here's a shot by Greenberg. That rebound was the most dangerous part of that shot, uh, and no one was able to get a stick on it. Uh, for the Eagles, most we started up went ahead and Fysik moved in, and that was the end of that. Uh, Fysik in the deep, couldn't hold on to it, spin from the line, not going to be able to keep it in, it's an automatic offside. On the flame, back to the commentary comment I was going to make. Second game of the day, I'm a little tired right now, I'm going to be quite frank with you. Uh, um, so I apologize for the gaps in the commentary, but <laughs> I'm not going to say, you know, 7.20 is my bedtime, but I certainly start to relax at 7.20, I'm not usually in a hockey rink at this time, but... Although we've had some late games this season for our, our high school season, of course, which is wrapped up by now. Uh, state championships were today. Uh, Hanover won the Division I championship. They beat Bedford 2-1. Uh, and John Stark Hopkinton won the Division III. Uh, Division twos. he's a... Uh, look out here, Greenberg coming to the net. He's gonna get a rebound there, and he put it off the outside of the cage. Uh, thing doing right now for the Eagles, though, turnover! Shot in the slack up, another one, and Kerr fended that off with the far pad. Eagles on this puck, they have 23 seconds left to go in power play time. Baker's still in the box. Uh, Novak uh, getting around Smithers, kicking it for Greenberg. McKenna's in front of the net. Uh, Novak still going, trying to wrap it out in front. McDonough was on the back door, but he's also on his back end. Couldn't get a stick on. Now in front, and Novak has scored. Oh, yeah. Eagles are on the board. Uh, persistence uh, pays off for Boston. Uh, and they get the goal, and they are within three. Uh, no chance of stopping that one for Tristan Kerr, who's moving from side to side to side to side to side <laughs> on that shift. Uh, there's that one right now. Eagles uh, probably need another one, I would say, to get back in this game for sure. Uh, although, uh, the goal by McKenna is a place to start, right? Uh, down by three. Here's Blast Pipe swung by to the kid from the bottom of the near side face off their goal. Uh, He goes out at center. Uh, here's McKee in across the line. Bumped by Bless. Uh, I'd have retaliated by throwing his arm back in his face there. No penalty called on either of the two. Young stick work beat out of the Eagle play over the puck. He will move it down. Young is skating up the middle of the ice. Uh, Young looking, tried that drop pass. Ox was not going to be able to catch up to it. And just a scrambling for a change as Pazchak comes in. Pazchak, he was receiving it from Hobson. Pazchuk still on it. Now for Hobson. Hobson back for Pazchuk. Looking at the side of the net. Still lose Kerr out to stop it. It's loose at the top of the crease. They battle away for it. It ends up in the corner, but not out. Eagles coming alive here with two minutes left to go in the second. Habermach in for Pazchuk. Missed his stick. Cycled in by the cage, and Derby finds it. Derby. He's trying to pass it up the middle of the ice. There's no one going up the middle of the ice. He's got two wingers, Maurice and uh, Baker, who are on the wings. <laughs> He's moving up the middle of the ice. I don't understand the point in that. Uh, 
This puck's not going to make it for icing. I don't know if Folsom was looking for Baker or not. Uh, nonetheless, Walpowitz takes it for Boston. Walpowitz up, and look out, Bill Smithers. To end of the bench and out of play. Coach Bill nearly got hit over there. Uh, crouching out of the way of the puck. Uh, 1.15 on the clock here in period two. Eagles uh, starting to get a little bit of, a little bit more chances than they've had for certain. Uh, in this lengthy second period, shot through traffic. There by Gromwell. Murphy was in front of the net. Uh, and the goaltender got a piece of it with the pad. Uh, now Fisek, uh, he got beat on the pass. Here comes McKenna to one on one. McKenna, he's right through after he beat Folsom clean and he can't launch a shot on. He was torn down up to the play. Here's Murphy. Murphy pushing the line, dropping it. Fisek waiting back in front for Murphy. And the defenseman came across to block it away. McDonough roughing up Murphy, although Murphy centered one. He was. A little bit of a blind pass there. Novak now trying try to catch up to it. He's going to catch up to it. Right in front. Paladino has And it's 4-2. to two. And Kerr looks stunned in net right now. It took a while, but the Eagles are using their speed to get goals. Uh, Novak charging hard at him. Paladino flying up the left side. I mean flying to get on that puck. Uh, and his shot was just as fast as he was. Uh, and just like that, the Eagles have scored two straight uh, and have made this a 4-2 hockey game. Uh, Aberbach uh, trying to lead up an end for Greenberg. Smithers is pinching, knocked it away with a skate. Manchester moving it around in close quarters. That's not going to do anybody good right now. Uh, and Smithers got beat again. Here's Novak, and he overskated the puck. Greenberg now driving it aligned. He split the seam and pushed it in behind the cage. Uh, he sees the clock's going to run out on him just as it does. Uh, teams tie it up in the second, but Manchester leading on their two goals in the first. 4-2. Uh, Flames. 